Everybody in this area puts the Mad River into their mouth every day. There are only a couple things more intimate than that. I have a very close relationship with the Mad River. I am over 60% of the Mad River myself. Hello, I'm John Griffith. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm here on the Mad River. I recently got my DNA tested through Ancestry.com because I wanted to know where, which part of the world my ancestors came from. And I got the results and since then I've been thinking a lot about relations and who I'm related to and how much. Like how much am I related to my cousins and my second cousins and my full-blooded siblings and my half-blooded siblings. And I've thought about relations in a lot of ways. A lot of different ways since then. That's when I realized who my closest relative by weight is. It's the Mad River. So this is the Mad River behind me. And this is where my town gets its water from. Since humans are 60% water, and I drink all my water out of this river, because my whole town drinks our water out of this river, then that means that I'm over 60% Mad River, making this my closest relative by weight. We drink water every day. We put well, in this area, we put the Mad River in our mouth every day. It's, we are the Mad River. Everybody in this town is the Mad River. Everybody in Arcata is the Mad River. Your water source is you. The Mad River flows for hundreds of miles and then into my house. Put the Mad River into my mouth every day. Have Mad River water all over my body every single day when I take a shower. When I boil pasta, I'm boiling pasta in the Mad River. I wash my clothes in the Mad River. I brush my teeth with the Mad River. I don't shave with the Mad River. I have a bowl in my house that fills up with Mad River water that I poop in. I am more than half Mad River. The Mad River is my closest relative. You're probably thinking that this sounds crazy. And you just found out the Mad River is in Humboldt County. And you know what happens in Humboldt County. So you're like, this dude is high. But I don't smoke drugs. I got better things to put in my mouth. I put the Mad River in my mouth every day. We love our relatives and we want to protect them, right? Especially a really, really close relative like the river here, the Mad River that I put in my mouth every day. If it's polluted, I'm polluted. If it ain't healthy, I ain't healthy. In 1972, Congress realized that the water we drink is our closest relative and they passed, they created, passed the Clean Water Act. Okay? It's the main law in the United States governing our bodies of water. So you'd think that since water is our closest relative, that no one would mess with the Clean Water Act, but that isn't true. In the last 20 years, there's been many attempts and some successful attempts at weakening the Clean Water Act. And so we need to tell the Environmental Protection Agency, EPA, that we love our closest relative by weight and we want to protect it. There's nothing more important. We put it in our mouth every day. So I'm gonna leave you some links to the National Wildlife Federation and some other places that will help you, will show you how you can get involved to make sure the EPA and those who are, that we've elected to oversee our most important relative, to make sure that they're doing their job. Because the only thing that should be happening to the Clean Water Act is it should be getting stronger, not weaker. But find out where your water comes from, look at it, realize that it's your closest relative by weight, it's in you all the time, you re-put it in you, okay? So people in my area, we are the Mad River. The Mad River goes into our mouth every day.